So let's look at the following example. Suppose a small insect is caught on the web of a spider and the web oscillates periodically with a frequency of 5 Hz. So the frequency is 5 cycles every single second. So in part A, we'd like to calculate the value of the spring stiffness constant K if the insect has a mass of 0.4 grams. So let's look at the top to bottom view of our spider web. It looks something like this. Let's suppose our insect is shown in blue. So the moment our insect lands onto our web, if we examine the side view of our web, we're going to see the following oscillation. So our spider web will oscillate back and forth in the following manner, where our change in X will be the amplitude of our oscillation. Now the only thing we're given in this problem is the frequency as well as the mass of our object. So that means if we want to calculate the spring stiffness constant K, we have to use the following equation. So the frequency of our harmonic motion is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi multiplied by the square root of K divided by M. So if we solve for K, we have the following result. So to find the spring stiffness constant K, we take the mass, which should be given in kilograms. So we take this and divide that by 1,000. So we take that and the product of 2 pi frequency squared, where frequency is simply 5 cycles per second. So we multiply these quantities out and we get a value of 0.39 newtons per meter. So this is our spring constant for the spider web. Now let's suppose that that insect was eaten and a second insect lands on our spider web that has a mass of 0.8 grams. So what is the new frequency of the oscillation of the spider web? So now we know what the spring constant is. We know what the mass of the insect is. So we simply use this formula to calculate the frequency. So the frequency is given by 1 divided by 2 pi times the square root of 0.39 newtons per meter, which we got in this part, divided by the mass of the insect in kilograms, 0.0008 kilograms. So we plug that into the calculator and we get a new frequency of 3.51 cycles per second.